Good morning, evening, afternoon, everyone. My name is Kaze, and it's uh, been a little while. I understand that a long span of time has passed since my last video, but it was because I was very busy and I just needed to get my schoolwork done. But school's winding down now, and I think I can start uploading normally again. You know, like I used to. Every <laughs> and. <laughs> but anyway. If you're in school, you probably either just finished or are just about to finish your spring break. In years past, spring break for me mainly consisted of me in my bedroom with the curtains closed, hugging a bowl of Fritos, watching some obscure anime, avoiding all social contact. This year, however, I thought it was time to take a chance and get out a little bit. Fortunately, my best friend Cassandra thought the same thing, so we took ourselves to the Windy City. That's right, Chicago. And me, being the vlogger friend that I am, decided to capture all of our experiences on camera and share them with the world. Now, before we begin this, I just want to apologize for my appearance as the day goes on. They don't call it the Windy City for nothing, and uh, by the end of some days, I'd be looking real ratchet. But without further ado, Kaze and Cassie take Chicago. And this is our new, new, our one and only Kaze and Ka Cassie take on Chicago series. <laughs> so, um, after one hell of a day yesterday, <laughs> I'm glad to say that I'm glad we're on the bus on time. Bus, train. <laughs> and. Look, we're heading off! And we're really early too. Like, it's only 6.52. There's a delay for 6.56. And it's 6.55 right now. But yeah, uh, me and my best friend are gonna take on Chicago. I'm gonna try to show you everything that I see, or the parts I bother to let you see. And, uh,. Next time you see us, we'll probably be at a stop or something. So, see you later. Hello everyone, it's Kaze again. We have just touched down in Chicago City. Woo! And, I have no uh, idea where we are. Yeah, we just got off the train and um, they gave us no maps. <laughs> I guess we could have looked for some, but we were just kind of following the crowd because we didn't know where we were going. It's like not too bad. Either. But uh, look at all these buildings. And now we're at a stoplight. Okay. Look at that. That's a Sears Tower, I believe. Oh, I can't even see the top of it. <laughs> so, um, what are we gonna do, Kelsey? Look for food. <laughs> we're not even gonna try to find out where our hotel is or break the law. We really need a map. We could use some, um... Am I being CBS? Do I want to use CBS? I guess. The best place we could find, figure a map being is at a hotel, but we need a map to find our hotel, so... I mean, you have GPS on your phone, bro. Let's get food. We'll get the bus map and try to find our stuff. And then we can get to the hotel from there. <laughs> Sounds like a plan. All right, we're gonna find food and get to our hotel, and then I'll spend. What? What? Subs. Oh, we found food, and it's it's Subway, and um, we think we know where we're going. Kind of a stretch. Yeah. Look how healthy this is. <laughs> Kathy, how are you feeling right about now? She's speechless, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> the majesty of Chicago has taken her breath away, truly. The art of this trip was to not know where we're going. <laughs> so, yeah, we're, we're, we're gonna eat and then maybe find the bus that'll take us to our hotel. Cultural Mile, one of the highlights of the Cultural Mile. 
uh, right up here. Right. At the aquarium, we saw many different types of aquatic life, including these, that, this, that, those. I think I saw that one in a Tumblr post once. Lake turtles, snapping turtles, freaking alligator turtles. Too good for the camera, apparently. Some dolphins. And my personal favorite, beluga whales. So graceful. Just, just look at him. Hey everyone, we just got back from the Shed Aquarium, and uh, it was awesome. <laughs> My favorite part was the belugas in the Oceanarium, because they are just so adorable. And just so cute. I think they were the babies too, because their skin was still white. Yeah. So. Who's your favorite part, Kathy? Hi. Um, the dolphins. I'm supposed to take that trolley bus that you might have seen <laughs> earlier to the spot closest to our hotel, but we missed it, so we have to wait another 30 minutes. <laughs> at least it's not an hour. <sighs> at least. Looking kind of ratchet. Could a few people through that guy. <laughs> <laughs> Little chilly. Can't really leave. Too cheap to actually get on another bus. <laughs> so, yeah. Fun times. What are we hitting tomorrow, Kathy? Yeah. We've got two days to hit four places, bro. <laughs> we got the sky deck tomorrow, tonight, and then we the elephant area, the museum, the mall. Ugh, oh, the mall. That's like a sixth stop. <laughs> Next time you see me, I'll probably be at the hotel, <laughs> crying a little bit. <laughs> and the time after that, we'll be on the sky deck. So, uh, catch it later. Look at this big ass McDonald's! <laughs> and then we're right by the Hard Rock Cafe and the Rainforest Cafe. This is a McDonald's with two floors. Everything here has two floors, including the Walgreens. Even the normal Walgreens has two floors. Hey everybody! We just got back to our hotel. <laughs> And if things went crazy enough, something else happened. I don't want to talk about it. Yeah, we'll, we'll just leave it out. But we're here now. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look at this room. It's the bomb diggity. But that's not all. We have ourselves our own little living room. Look at this hookup. We've got two TVs. <laughs> If I want to watch Lifetime and she wants to watch some Spike, it's on a pop. Really? <laughs> I don't watch TV. I don't know channels. We've got our bathroom here. It's a very standard setup, but you know. Ooh, is that knapsack for free? I'm gonna take it. I doubt it. There's like a faucet here. Probably just for making this coffee. That's that's how cold. We're drinking the tap water because you only pay four dollars for a water bottle. <laughs> True words have never been spoken. I did not show them our view. <laughs> There's nothing to write home about, but there'll be lights when I look outside. We're gonna talk to you guys later. Uh, next time we see us, we will be up in 100 floors? 302. 302 floors. I've made a mistake. <laughs> Chicago is so pretty. Hey everybody! We are at McDonald's. Got back from Skydeck. Well, you saw that too. So what are we doing tomorrow, Kelsey? So maybe we should do all of these rooms tomorrow. And then do the shopping. Do you know we have to carry a bag around? You can check out at 12? We'll figure it out. But um, today's been super fun. I think Chicago is awesome. What have you thought about a cabin? I love Chicago. Really? That was quite diverse. That taxi driver was kind of nice. You didn't say anything. <laughs> But uh, I'm starving, so I'm gonna eat now and see you when we get back to the hotel. 
sounds of the Windy City. This is weird, their viewfinder. Welcome to the Embassy Suite Chicago downtown. You may have noticed that our centralized location attracts many different sounds <laughs> that may impact your visit. Please utilize the attached complimentary earplugs to minimize these urban distractions. Thank you for staying with us, and enjoy the city. Now, the problem with- it's a very nice gesture, and we appreciate it. However, there's a key element missing from this. <laughs> there's nothing on the back. There were no complimentary earphones. <laughs> we're going through a lot of emotions right now. <laughs> Mostly good, though. It's nice. We're watching. What are we watching? We're watching... Uh, guys Grocery Games, maybe? Guys Grocery Games. Guy... Oh, what's his last name? He starts with an F. Fieri. Guy Fieri's... G games of... Food. Groceries. Yeah. Cassie had noticed that, um, anyone in that adjacent building could see us at this level or higher, as long as our window, window, curtains. yeah, <laughs> as long as our curtains stay open. The thought terrified us as much as it fascinated us. Please say you close them when you changed. <laughs> well. It wasn't that much of a show. <laughs> I took pants on, I put them back on. Took pants on. Took pants on. <laughs> <laughs> Can I watch some telly? And then, uh, probably go to bed. It feels like 10 o'clock. Yeah, I can't get used to this whole central time thing, man. No. <laughs> it means we're gonna be up even earlier. <laughs> oh, 5 a.m. <laughs> Up at breakfast bar. Where's the food? <laughs> the next time you see us, we'll probably be on the trolley trying to think of what we're gonna do. Yeah. <laughs> <For breakfast. laughs> wow, vlogging at breakfast. We're definitely gonna have to be the only people there, or it's gonna be weird. <laughs> so, uh, catch you then.